that we all drink. Think about it. In 1970, each New Yorker drank the equivalent of about five cans of soda a week and drank 10 glasses of milk, along with water and natural fruit juices. Back then, overweight and obesity were not nearly the problem they are now. Today, on average, we each drink the equivalent of 11 cans of soda a week, and only six eight ounce glasses of milk. Sugar sweetened beverages are pretty much just liquid sugar. Half of the extra six cans of soda per week are sugar sweetened soda. Drinking three extra cans of soda a week means that over the course of a year, we take in about 13 more pounds of straight sugar, which is more than 21,000 calories. When we take in more calories than we need, our bodies convert them to fat. 21,000 extra calories becomes about six pounds of fat, and that's just one year's worth. Good luck trying to hide this on an adult, let alone a child. This graph shows what's happened to our beverage drinking habits in our bodies over the last 30 or 40 years. In 1970, we each drank about 31 gallons of milk a year and 24 gallons of soda, and only a little more than 4% of children were obese. In 1985, we drank 27 gallons of milk and 31 gallons of soda. By 2005, we were drinking only 21 gallons of milk and 35 gallons of soda, and 17% of our children were obese. Today, over 34% of our children are overweight or obese.